Hello YouTube, it is Bob Stuntsville. Today is going to be a special day. Today, I am going to do my first review on a gun from Pixel Strike 3D, the heavy rifle. The stats are as follows, 28 damage, 60 range, a recoil of 8, a fire rate of 5.3 bullets a second. Also some information the other reviewers won't give you are, it takes 3 head shots, or 4 body shots, or 4 leg shots to kill someone, a head shot does 42 damage, and a body shot does 28 damage, and a leg shot does 26 damage. Hollow points does 45 damage for a head shot, 30 damage for a body shot, and 28 damage for a leg shot. Yeah, you don't see anyone else giving info like that on YouTube. Range and spread are odd things to talk about in a review, but I'm trying to go really technical here. This is supposed to be the review above reviews. Not saying that this is the best, but I'm just saying that's what I'm aiming for. The audience really decides which is the best review. But enough of my rambling, let's get on to the tests. Here are some tests that I did concerning three main things. The spread with and without steady aim and laser, the recoil with and without the red dot sight and foregrip, and the amount of time you can shoot with and without mag extensions. First we have accuracy. With this one I have no attachments or perks, and the second test I have the laser sight and steady aim. Any information about how to do these tests in a little more detail will be at the end of the testing section. Also, something you might have noticed is that I have laser sight on both tests. They affect recoil and not the actual spread of bullets, though I am assuming that most people have laser sight as an attachment already. The next test is on recoil. My first test, I had just normal everything, and for the second test, I had the laser sight and foregrip. The results were to be expected, more on point with the bullets as recoil was set to low. The last test I did was how much longer can you fire with extended mags. For the first test I just had me shooting for the regular old magazine, and in the next test I was firing the extended magazine. The extended magazine adds 50% more bullets, or 15 more bullets, and the total time are on the screen for the two tests. The time for the normal magazine takes 5.8 seconds and the extended mag takes 8.8 .8 seconds. In total, that's 3 more seconds. The total magazine does 84 damage, while the extended mag does around 420 more damage. In short, the different attachments and perks are to suit different playstyles. If you're good at aiming, try steady aim. If you're good at avoiding recoil, then try foregrip. If you're not so good at timing your reloads, or always find that you're out of ammo, try extended mags. They all fit the different playstyles. There really is no best one for everybody. Everyone plays differently. So equip to which one suits your preferred playstyle. If you want to replicate this test, then stand here, here, and here. Make sure you hug the walls. Now the heavy rifle is a good choice in close range and medium range combat, shown in the previous tests. This is not very good in long range combat though, just because of it's really bad at being accurate over long distances. The bullets do heavy damage, but do fire out slower than other rifles in the game. I guess you could say that it takes aim, because if you miss a lot of your shots, you won't stand a chance in a firefight. Also, please do not equip hollow points you will be wasting the attachment. It still takes the same amount of shots to kill someone whether you have hollow points or not. 3 headshots and 4 body shots. Equip something else, like the aforementioned steady aim or extended mag attachment. Some final thoughts for me would be that the heavy rifle isn't for everyone. Try to pick it up, get the attachments, and see if you like it. Try it out. If you don't like it, try something else, like the M60 or the Battle Rifle. 
And if I were to give this heavy rifle a score, 1 through 10, I'd give it a 9. It's a very fun gun to play with, and it gets the job done. Anyways, my name is Bubsonsville, and make sure you view the video, make sure you set this video as your wallpaper, and I'll mess you, make sure you set, set, um, bookmark this video. Okay, have a nice day, bye.